If you're like me and want to make your own hive top feeder, but after extensive internet searches, you've come up empty trying to find the diameter hole saw that you'll need to cut this hole, search no further. Spoiler alert, it is 71 millimeters. How do I know that? A caliper. There we go. Where can you get them? Amazon. Link in the description. In my extensive internet searching, I found all sorts of shapes and sizes that people claim is the right one. You might have found two and three quarter inches. You might have found 2.8 inches. 2.8 inches is right. I think that's what equates to 71 millimeters. Uh, but if you want to buy them on the internet, typically you have to find a 71 millimeter. Where you can find that, I found them on Amazon. A lot of different ones. Some come with Arbor, some, with, some don't. Uh, my most recent purchases, I got three of them recently. First one did not come with one. The second two, for instance, this, guess where it comes from? It comes from China. Um, but it only took me, I think it took about two to three weeks to get them. So I bought three of them just so I've got enough hanging around the house. We'll go ahead and hook one up, cut a hole, and give it a little test run. Here's the fit we end up with. It's a nice tight seal. The rim at the top of the lid keeps everything nice and snug. Hopefully keeps as much water out as we can. So if you came here to determine how to make a hive top feeder, it's as simple as getting a piece of plywood that fits exactly over the top of your beehive. Get a 71 millimeter hole saw and cut a hole in the center of that piece of plywood. Get yourself a ball mason jar, cut about, poke about five holes in it with a small nail, fill it with sugar water, flip it upside down on top of that hole, and it's as simple as that. I got to thinking about hole saw sizes and thought maybe a 70 millimeter lid might give me an even, even tighter fit than what the 71 millimeter hole gives me. This is a two and three quarter inch hole saw. If you look at the side of it, it says 70 millimeters, two and three quarter inches. So they claim it, they're claiming it's the same thing. So I went ahead and cut a two and three quarter inch hole or 70 millimeter hole right here next to our 71 millimeter. And look what happens. When you try to fit your lid, it won't go in there all the way. You'll have about two, three eighths inch remaining that can't fit in there. When we put it in the 70 millimeter or 71 millimeter hole, we get a nice tight fit right to the, to the lip, flip it upside down. It doesn't fall out. Nice tight fit. Keep in mind, like I said, it'll take about two to three weeks for you to get one of these. So if you purchase them on Amazon, it's going to cost you about $9. It's coming from China. Two to three weeks later, you're going to have it. So plan accordingly because you want to have your hive top feeders on and ready to go before the dirt. Hope the video helped you out in your hive top feeder search. If you have any questions, let me know and thanks for watching.